morning, Indian Trail. This is Mr. Lubing with your daily Wildcat Wire news. Today is Thursday, September 24th, 2020. Please join me in saying the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. We would like to wish a very happy birthday to D Diego A, Luis A, and Mrs. Bo, who is celebrating her 21st birthday. The weather today is a high of 79 degrees with intervals of clouds and sunshine. On this day in history, in 1957, Elvis Presley released his soon-to-be hit single, Jailhouse Rock. And in 2007, The Big Bang Theory starring Jim Parsons, Kaylee Cuoco, and Johnny Galecki premiered on CBS. And everyone started to knock on doors like this. Benny? 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 Since it's officially fall, we wanted to provide you with some fun fall facts. The first one, did you know fall is caused by the Earth's tilt, not our distance from the sun? When the northern hemisphere tilts toward the sun, we get warmer. When it tilts away, we get colder. Fall and spring are the times of transition. The second fall fact, did you know weight gain around this time of year may not be from the food you eat? Researchers have found that lack of vitamin D reduces fat breakdown and triggers fat storage. So the lack of sunlight has more to do with the extra gain than all the pumpkin spice lattes. Well, at least some of it. Speaking of pumpkin spice lattes, the third fall fact, did you know pumpkin spice has nothing to do with pumpkins? Pumpkin spice is actually the spice mix used for pumpkin pies. It is made from cinnamon, ginger, nutmeg, allspice, and cloves. There's your fall facts. For today's Thoughtful Thursday, we would like you to think back about your week and identify three things that you are thankful for. Remember, these should be specific, and if you feel comfortable, it's a great idea to share them with others. This week, we are encouraging you to keep a log or journal for yourself where you can write positive things that happen to you during the week and what you are thankful for. If at any time during your week you are feeling down, you can look back in your journal and read things that you are thankful for. Remember that practicing gratitude helps your brain to focus on positive things that happen to you, rather than complaining or thinking about negative things. We now turn to a special report from 8th grader Natalie Ailman. Natalie? In recent news, Justice Ruth Bader Ginsburg passed away this past Friday. She died at age 87 of complications from pancreatic cancer. Ginsburg was an inspiration to us all and influenced many people to become who they are today. Justice Ginsburg was the second ever female Supreme Court justice and prior to that had done many things that greatly impacted our country. She was nominated for the Supreme Court by former B President Bill Clinton in 1993. Ginsburg earned her bachelor's degree at Cornell University and went on to teach at Rutgers Law School as well as Columbia Law School. Ruth spent most of her career pining for gender equality, something many people admire her for to this day. She was the director of the Women's Rights Project of the American Civil Liberties Union in the 1970s and believed that all groups are entitled to the same rights. Also in 1999, she won the American Bar Association's Thurgood Marshall Award for contributions to gender equality. Her early cases include fighting for reproductive health care and equal pay. She has always supported cases that include state-funded support for the disabled and legalizing gay marriage. Her contribution to the Supreme Court was a large part of her legacy, but she has done so much more. No wonder she was dubbed the notorious RBG. Ruth Bader Ginsburg has torn apart sexist structures in public as well as private life, speaking truth to power. After all, you cannot spell truth without Ruth. Ginsburg once said, fight for the things that you care about, but do it in a way that will lead others to join you. Thank you, Justice Ginsburg, for your service and for being a role model to so many young women across the country. 
Thanks, Natalie, and thank you, Justice Ginberg, for your service. That about wraps it up for us here today. Remember that today is a B-Day. Be sure that you attend your B-Day Encore classes. Thank you again for watching The Wildcat Wire. Remember to start each day with a positive attitude, face new challenges head on, and always rise above. Have a great day, Wildcats.